Good morning, I'm Polarized Moon, and welcome back to RuneScape. When we last left off, I completed the last quest on my recommended quests list, and I'm going to start looking at the ones I have on my other list, I guess. Alright, what have we for quests? Ernest the Chicken. Goblin Diplomacy. Imp Catcher. Pirate's Treasure. Shield of Arav. Swept Away and Vampire Slayer. Well, let's start at the top again, because that's what I've been doing. Speak to Veronica outside Drainer Manor. I can do that. Let's do some home teleport to Drainer since I have that activated. I should probably, you know, activate that Port Serum one sometime soon too. Which I haven't been to Port Serum yet, have I? I remember that was a, a pretty, that was a place I went to a lot when I played originally. Alrighty. Let's up this creepness factor by 10. Let's go past death here. And talk to Veronica. <clears throat> Let's see, is this, is this quest voice acted? Apparently not. <clears throat> Can you please help me? I'm in a terrible spot of trouble. My fiancé, Ernest, and I came upon this house. Seeing as we were a little lost, Ernest decided to go in and ask for directions. That was an hour ago, and that house looks spooky. Can you go and see if you can find him for me? Accept quest. <clears throat> thank you, thank you, I'm very grateful. I think I was spotted some lights flashing on the top floor windows, so you may want to head up there fast. Will do. Enter the courtyard of Drainer Mansion. Thank you, I did. A large double door. Has it got a sign on it? It's got a blank sign. There's a sign on the door that says, Adventurers beware. Going in doesn't mean you will come out again. Do you want to open? Yes, I do. Oh, this looks fancier than it did before. Let's zoom out so I can see what I'm doing. Uh, I believe that they are up on the top floor. Let's see, where's the la- oh, there's a ladder. A layout slightly different than I remember. Ghosty Goose! Oh my gosh, level 25. Here we go. Examine chicken. A strange chicken. And here we go with Professor Odenstein. <clears throat> Let's see, what kind of voice should I give him? Be careful in there! There's lots of dangerous equipment! I'm looking for a guy called Ernest. Ah, Ernest, top-notch bloke. He's helping with me with my experiments. Uh, so do you know where he is? He's that chicken over there. Ernest is a chicken. Are you sure? Oh, he isn't normally a chicken. Or at least he wasn't until he helped me test my Poltimorph machine. He was going to be called a transmutation machine, but after testing it, Poltimorph seems more appropriate. I'm glad Veronica didn't actually get engaged to a chicken. Who's Veronica? Ernest's fiance? She probably doesn't want to marry a chicken. Oh, I don't know. She could have free eggs for breakfast every morning. I think you'd better change him back. Um, that's not so easy. My machine is broken and the house is long-term pestered by poltergeists. They seem to reap joy from hiding my belongings. And in this case... The vital parts to my machine. Uh, well, I can look for them. That would be a huge help. They'll be somewhere in the main house, or its grounds outside. I'm missing a pressure gauge and a rubber tube. They've also taken my oil can, which I'm going to need to get this thing started again. Any clues? Well, I don't know. I wouldn't be surprised if you found something in my IQ testing room under the manor where I test my... Creations. Oh, and if I were you, I'd stay away from the coffin in the basement. Even the poltergeists don't go near it. Alright. Will do. And I know the oil can is in the basement. I remember doing this quest. It doesn't seem to have changed that much. The dialogue is, but the quest doesn't seem to have. Now, how do I get... Okay, there's the basement over there. Squeak... Um, ex uh, examine wall. 
A section of wall. Um, I don't remember this being quite like this. Oh, okay, here we go. How much did I pull that? Yoink! Yeah! Climb down the ladder. Hi-ho, hi-ho, it's off to the basement we go. And here's like a lever pulley system. Oh, the doors are uh, color-coded now? Um, and there's the oil can. All right, lever A, lever B. Okay, well, let's just try lever A. What did that do? That opened nothing. Well, let's pull lever B. Oh, you can see the door being opened now. Well, that's fantastic. I remember back when uh, when I did this quest, none of none of that stuff. You had to go and examine the door or something. Pull lever C. Let's see what happens then. Um, pull lever D. Uh, let's pull lever C again. And that opened that over there. Okay, that opened this. So I can close one of these. Because I need to get those open. Now, what did that do for me? Okay, that kept this one open. And open that one. There we go. Perfect. Wow, this is so much easier than I remember it being. And that's not yet open. Now pull this one. That opens this. And this. So I... Okay, so the pulled ones are... Okay, so the ones that are up on top need to be up for the door to be open. So I need blue up, orange up, and yellow up. Is that how that works? Well, I got that open. Now I can't get out of here. Oh, what about red? Or what uh purple? Let's op let's pull down the purple one. Let's see how that does. Aha! Got it. Man, I remember when I first did this, it took me like an hour to figure that out. And here it took me like 5 minutes. Open door. Take oil can for the chicken. And I'm gonna kill a rat because I can. Dead. Alrighty. I have the oil can. And the rubber hose is behind the staircase. Yeah, so this, this quest hasn't particularly changed at all. Uh, what was that noise? Right, open this door with the lever, I'm assuming. So the layout of stuff has changed, but that's about it. Um, now let's see. How do I get that door open? I remember there's a key somewhere. And I need the poison and the fish food. To There used to be a witch in here a long time ago. Okay, let's see. So I need to take the poison from here and the fish food from the top floor and mix those together and put them in the fountain outside that has piranhas in it. Does this still... This still needs a... 
This still needs a door or a key, doesn't it? The door is locked, yes. Um Let's go up the stairs and go find the the That is the creepiest looking picture I've ever seen. Oh wait, the eyes move. I, I should have known that. That's really cool. Um I remember the fish food like being over here or something. Just some junk. Uh, yeah, it was in this room. Um, do I have to search something now? Or did somebody take it? Where was the key for that room? What's over here? Oh, there's a ghost. And that will attack me because I am nowhere near the level to fight that. Oh, yeah, somebody took it. There's the fish food. There we go. And I am should not fight that thing because it's going to kill me. Head down the stairs. That's right, I have to go over here to get outside. Oh, well, let's mix the fish food, poison fish food. There we go. I remember some of what I'm supposed to do. I remember the chairs in here used to follow you. And I think I need the spade. Um, I don't need a bronze helmet. I can drop that. Clank. So, up and around. These trees used to, like, swipe at you. I don't know if they do anymore. Gallows! Not your average garden feature. Oh, that's right. This compost heap has the key in it. Yeah, I'm like speed running this shiz. And then the fountain is over here. Use poisoned fish food with the fountain. Search fountain. There seems to be a pressure gauge in here. And a lot of dead fish. Alright, let's... Oh, did I just get swiped up by a tree? I think I may have. Alright, let's go back in. I love, I love the noise that door makes. Um, and open this door with the key. Kill the skeleton. Oh, and he's got like a satchel. That's kind of cool. Well, this is going to take no time at all. Kick. And... Die. There we go. Air rune. Oh, let's loot all that. Grab these. Bury these bones. And take the rubber tube. Alrighty. Let's throw these down here. Is that That's everything. That was fast. Took me like 14 minutes. Well, that was easy. Have you found everything yet? Give him here then! I think I've used that voice for someone else before. I can't quite remember. The machine hums and shakes. Thank you, sir. It was dreadfully irritating being a chicken. How can I cluck? Ever thank you. A cash reward is always nice. Of course, of course. You may have these eggs and... Cluck! Feathers mysterious... Bark! Found in my pockets. You have completed Ernest the Chicken. Sweet. And I've got eggs and feathers. That was awesome. And let's head out of here. And I've got a whole five another minutes five nether minutes. I am really good at talking today. I've got a whole five nether minutes to finish my quest. Or to finish my episode. <laughs> Do the trees bite at you anymore? I don't, even, I don't even know. Well, let's see. What quest to do now? Well, I'll throw this stuff in my bank. Might be a good idea. I want to thank you guys again for all the support. I mean, 
a hundred over a hundred subscribers in less than my on my in my first month of becoming a YouTuber. I mean, I can't I can't hardly believe it. I mean, you know, I I thought this was gonna be like one of those things where I'd get like one subscriber a week or something for like a year, and then maybe you know all that jazz. I I can't <laughs> I can't believe it. Well, let's see what else we got. Goblin Diplomacy. This is the one where I have to go and, like, mix dyes and stuff and make dyed armor. I can start this quest by speaking to Generals Wartface and Bent Nose in the Goblin Village. Which I know how to get to. It's a good thing that I know the map. Uh, Edgeville, Birthroped, Falador would be the easiest. Because that's just north of the... Let's get rid of this... Get Click out of that, yeah. There we go. Haha! Musicians! I still. Yeah. I... What mini games are for non members? I don't even. I don't even remember. Or. No, I guess. That's where you get the wine. Bong. Uh, and in here. Talk to Bent Nose and Warp Face. We should have green- we should wear green armor. Green armor? Are you stupid? You stupid! Only stupid goblins think red armor better! No they don't! Me think red armor better! That because you stupid! Me not stupid! Then why not like green armor? Because uh, red armor better! Only stupid goblins think that you stupid. <laughs> um, do you want me to pick an armor color for you? Yes, as long as you pick green. No, no, you have to pick red. Uh, what about a different color? Not green or red. That would mean me wrong, but at least what face not right. Me don't know what look like. Have to seek armor before we decide. Human, you bring us armor in new color. What color we try? Orange armor might be good. Yep, bring us orange armor. Can do, but I will do that in the next episode, because that's all the time I've got for today. Like and favorite if you liked the episode, subscribe if you liked me, good night, and I will see you tomorrow. Psychics, you know, cuz TV show, yeah, uh, yeah, no, I'll shut up now. Yes. How did you know that? Well, you seem to be the only person here with a leaf attached to your forehead.